Good day, good day. How the hunk are you? Welcome to Roverland. This is your friend Dan O. And what do we got here on Roverland today? Well, it's a one on Wednesday. But wait, you say, Dan O. We got three. I'm seeing triples. Yeah, that's a uh, optical illusion. <laughs> so anyway. I had these, I bought these off eBay uh, here and there uh, in the past. And uh, there's a story behind them. There's a story why I bought them. And here's the story now. And we're going to take a look at this. So what we're looking at is the Welly Nex brand diecast metal scale models. And we're looking at what is the Land Rover Defender, all right? And you notice here I got a little tag in this one because I bought this uh, from Patty. And Patty is from Chicago, Illinois, all right? And uh, wrote me a nice note and everything. This is, I'm going to show you the note here. Thank you for and thank you and enjoy your Land Rover Patty. And look at the little dog and the little cat, you know, St. Juice. Okay. Anyway, this is why I bought this from Patty. Apparently, um, in in um, Chicago, well, not apparently in Chicago. In Chicago. There is the Chicago Auto Show that is in early February, like February 7th, 2020. Uh, it it uh, took off this year. Uh, it's like a week-long uh, McCormick building in uh, Chicago. Uh, I took my son and I there one time uh, several, several moons ago. He was a little lad then. Um, anyway... Awesome. I'd like to go back maybe uh, 2021. I will go again. Uh, that will be awesome. But anyway, this last year, February 2020, at the Chicago Land or Chicago Auto Show in early February, it was reported that Land Rover was giving out these boxes at the Land Rover show, or at, at, at the Chicago show at the Land Rover booth. I don't have much more information than that. I don't know, sometimes they do special release, release uh, parties that for new models and stuff like that, and you gotta buy tickets, and then you get door prizes and such like that. But as far as what Patty says here, these were given out at the... Chicago Auto Show in 2020. All right, and I bought. Um, I think Patty told me for sure. Uh, I think one of them uh, mentioned it uh, also that these were given out, and uh, I got these for regular for a uh, pretty good price. You know, they were uh, ten fifteen dollars, but they were in the box and. Uh, Pretty cool. So, one on Wednesday, uh, these are the one and only that I have of this, and I was going to open one. But, see this hand? This is my left hand. And see this hand? This is my right hand. And sometimes in my collection, I have box stuff over there, and I have loose stuff over there, and the right hand, the right hand, don't know what the left hand has, right? So, I had these in a special spot because I just got these just this year and um i have other land rovers wellies in another spot over here in a loose uh display so anyway we're gonna get to the end of that story but something i want to show you about this one here in particular and i'm i i am guessing i'm totally speculating that this is what this is my uh, theory on why they were doing this. But anyway, here we have the Welly in a box next models. Um, and this is a one thirty eight scale. Um, as far as I know, these came in white, silver, blue, and red and black, I believe. Um, 
they kind of give them between 134 scale and 139 scale but um, interesting interesting uh, oh I was gonna show you the bottom here just kind of a plain Jane kind of a box um, not really too exciting there uh, here's the side of it very nice you know very nice box uh, did I show you the bottom and then showed you the back all right there's the bottom and the back all right so let me show you something interesting and they all have it and ba bam let's take a look at this end here this is a scale bottle Land Rover 2011 Range Rover Evoke pullbacks 138 scale white made in China does that, <laughs> does that look like a 2011 Range Rover Evoke no it doesn't so I'm wondering I'm just wondering if Wellies had a mistake in the packaging had them all packaged up was looking for somebody to dump them to you know because it, I don't know couldn't sell them because they were screwed up but that is not a sticker that is printed right on there and all all three of them have it um, so kind of unique in that way so I, like I say I don't know if Welly just got rid of these and uh, Chicago area uh, Land Rover dealerships bought it bought them as a lot and gave them away as prizes or gifts I am not sure but that's what I'm thinking they were a mistake in production they were given away uh, as uh, gifts from the Land Rover uh, Chicago Auto Show group or whatever and um, there you have it so talking about that left hand not knowing what the right hand is yes siree I'm gonna tag the video I have a white one loose so I don't have to open it up it is the exact same uh, thing yeah it is the exact same thing uh, here it is in white beautiful that has uh, uh, lens details in the headlight in the turn signals beautiful beautiful truck uh, these oh, doors do open Ugh. Uh, they open yes they open all right we'll get it open oh man that them new cars you know they can't open the doors too well this is a left hooker as you see uh, it has the interior door panel on it very very nice um, this does I think these uh, back doors open I don't want to pull too hard on the uh, on the tire there but I believe the back door does open there's a big huge crack in the uh, die cast so I'm assuming that it opens and it doesn't look like it okay maybe it does maybe it doesn't wow it sure does look like it should but uh, anyway on, on this model it, it, anyway it doesn't open but uh, let's just move on beautiful beautiful back end here painted on uh, uh, the uh, turn signals the uh, backup light and uh, this big big red light I'm not really sure what that one is uh, our uh, lens details uh, Land Rover on the mud flaps very very nice uh, this one I boy I must not open the doors very much on this one because they are stiff um, but very nice details now this one is is a pullback it is and uh, very very nice so that is the loose one um, that I have of the the boxed ones so maybe I should uh, put the boxed ones over with the loose ones I don't know but anyway talking about that here we've got the silver one yes same darn tootin thing huh cheese balls I can't believe that I had these in two separate places and uh, I, I did I did put the right with the left and the left with the right and I go to do this video and I'm like you know what um, I guess maybe it was the fear of having to open one of these because they are sealed on the on the ends they they are sealed and uh, maybe the fear of having to open something uh, 
jarred my memory <laughs> and said, hey, Dano, Dano, you got these. And you got a white, a gray, and yes siree, a black one. Yeah, so <laughs> there you go. I couldn't believe it. Uh, but anyway, for a one-off Wednesday, just a quick little chat about the Welly Nex uh, models and this precarious, precarious um, label on the side. Can anybody give me any idea of what's going on here, okay? Please do, please do. All right, that's it. I'm out of here. Come on over to Facebook, Roverland, Instagram at Roverland Channel. And, uh, yeah, give me a big thumbs up. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Almost 300. Well, by this time this one gets posted, we'll probably have 300. Yes, the 300 Spartans have finally decided to subscribe to Roverland, and that's awesome. All right. I'm out of here. Thank you very much for joining me today. And as always, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great Rover day.